you going? Yeah, how about yours? How was, what was today like? Final Comic Con, the final season? What are the emotions like? I am at the brink of tears, even now. <laughs> we are all emotional. I don't want to say emotional wrecks. We are just emotional. So what do you, what's your biggest hope for next season? What, what do you, I mean, that's a huge question, yeah, I know. it's an amazing but, question. It's, I, I have... Both for, both for your character and for the, the show in general. Mm -hmm. This is the people pleaser in me, but I just want to do our fans proud. Like, I just want them to feel like they have closure and they have, a, the show has a legacy that speaks to people and, um, I think the legacy of the show is really what I, what I want to get out of it. It's like some, yeah. something strong and impactful uh, that really puts a nice button on the end of the story and makes nice. people feel better. If yeah. your Thank you. character survives and you were able to choose any of the other DC shows, you can just guest star. Which oh. one would you choose? Legends. <laughs> I love Legends. With no history. No. First of all, a lot of my friends are on the show, so that, that Start helps. pitching now. Be like, these are my powers. These are hard. Are you listening? <laughs> like, I, no, really. You'd be uh, good on Legends. They uh, need more girls. Yeah. Oh, yeah. that's true. Yeah, yeah. It's most of guys are Legends. Yeah, I love, I love that show. It's so fun. It makes me, like, belly laugh when I watch it. And um, also, Katie Lotz is, like, really one of my greatest inspirations. And every time that I work with her, I learned so much, like not only about how to do our job, but just like about to like how to be just like a strong person who's good at what I mean, she's amazing, so that would be a dream. Yeah. So which time period has become the more fun for you or the more interesting for you? The future or the present? <laughs> That's like that question. so fun and interest uh, fun and interesting are sort of fun wise, uh, the future yeah. because it's so different uh, to what we normally do, and when you play the same character for this many years, you know it's great to have something that really is a change up. And uh, um, no, no, that would be interesting because it's not as fun the future because the makeup sucks. <laughs> fun wise, the present, interesting one is the future. Yeah. What can you tease about what we can expect from Dinah's arc this year? Well, to be honest, I don't know where she ends uh, the season, which is the interesting thing about doing film versus uh, or television versus film because you don't really you don't really know. You're kind of going in blind. Mm -hmm. uh, but I think, from what I know, she is uh, she's coming into herself, and because she's always been so sort of torn, and there's always been this duality between you know, am I a vigilante, am I a police uh, officer? I, uh, I hope that she sort of settles in, into that result and she finds her place. Yeah. Yeah. Well, 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 building into Crisis, which is going to be like the biggest thing that this has ever done, is there anybody that you are optimistic, a lot of hopeful that you get to kind of get a scene to do with? Like, because it's going to be so many people from across the entire history of DC. I get a scene with Ruby Rose. I'm oh, sorry, somebody's recording on this. I, well, that tells you right there. <laughs> <laughs> Ruby Rose is my favorite character. Um, I, I, I think she's going to be great. Yeah, I've been a fan for a while. <laughs> Thanks so much, guys. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you, guys. Thank nice you. to meet you.